All right, we're in my bathroom. I'm gonna show you how to wear lenses, but first we need to wash our hands, okay? Whenever you're touching your eyes or putting your lenses, anything to do with your eyes, wash your hands. So that's what I'm doing. Dry them. Don't mix your solution with water. It's like a science teacher here. Okay, now I can't see anything, okay? Like, I'm, I don't even know what I'm looking right now. I hope I'm in the center of the camera. So my left eye is minus four and right is minus 4.25. It just went up this year. Um, this is a standard lens packaging and I use the AccuView. Am I seeing this right? Okay, I'm gonna show you what lenses I'm wearing later. But let me put on my lenses first. All right, so I have right and left. This is my right one. So I'm taking this lens, I'm placing it in the palm of my hand, and then I'm taking this. This is the Renew lens solution, very regular. I'm gonna pour it on my hand generously. We don't wanna cheap out on the lens solution because you're cleaning your lenses. I'm gonna take my finger, and I'm just gonna start cleaning it very lightly. And then I'm gonna pick it up. Sometimes it takes two, three tries because there are, you know, particles in it. So, you know, small little fine dust particles. And I go in with another round and I try and clean it even further without touching my nail to it. I'm just doing my finger. Okay, this should be good. I need a mirror, so I don't know how I'm gonna show you, but... That was creepy AF, right? But that's how I do it. I just like... So my nail doesn't come in contact only with my lenses at all. Okay, now I can see <laughs> with one eye. Taking my left eye, taking my left contact lenses, you know how to pick it up, right? Just make sure you are pouring the solution every time. I've seen a lot of people pick up the lenses straight from here and put it in the eye, which I can't do because that solution has been sitting for like days or like hours and you put the same thing in your eye? No, 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 no. You wanna wash it with fresh solution so that it is clean for your eyes. Lift it and place it. Ta-da, vision! I can see, mama, I can see. <laughs> my gosh, I need to get LASIK, but now I can't because my number went high. So, done. That's how easy and quick it is to wear lenses with nails. You literally take it in this palm. Then you want to wash your lens case and then you want to keep it like this or like this to dry, no problem. I'll keep it like this. Okay, I'm too close to you guys but I'm taking the Vitamin Glow from Smashbox and I'm just going to put that all, all over my skin. This is a quick get ready, okay? Quick, quick. Face looks so dull, dude really 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 need a facial and then i'm taking the maybelline fit me dewy and smooth normal to dry primer and i'm just gonna put that all over my face because i love this primer it is so hydrating hydrating primers are my favorite because i'm so extremely dry pore minimizing primer primers are my important steps you know this is like my foundation before my foundation so I have to like create a very good base for me to put any sort of makeup. It doesn't matter whether it's full coverage, whether it's glam, every day. These hydrating primers have to go all over my face because I'm taking the L'Oreal Infallible Wear Concealer in Amber straight up, okay? This is the one, no, nothing, no foundation, nothing. This is my go-to everything right now because I'm just going close by to home you know just want to look presentable wow my dark circles have really really gone up oh yeah i slept at 4 30 yesterday and woke up at 9. wow your face really tells you that you've slept less that's crazy While it's baking, I'm just gonna do a little bit of brows. I'm taking the Precisely My Brow. Not doing anything crazy, just filling up the gaps to give it a shape. I'm 
taking the Rare Beauty Cream Blush, like you can see. I've used it a lot. This is in the shade Nearly Neutral. So cute. And I'm just going to pop on the cream blush on top over here. Because I didn't set all of this part, you know. I can still put the cream blush and it's going to look nice and fresh. Just a pop of color on the cheek does really well if you want to step out. Just foundation concealer is not the best you guys because I have seen people come with just foundation concealer and nothing else on the face and it looks super flat it looks like you've painted something on you know so for dimension you have to add color whether it's your bronzer whether it's your blush I recommend blush over bronzer on a regular day um, just adding that cute little color will just elevate the makeup and look a little natural I'm gonna put a teeny bit mascara because my lashes are too flat. I love this thick applicator. It may be irritating for some people because it's so fat, but I feel like that's what gives it like that voluminous look to the lash. Now, lipstick is my favorite. Lipstick is what gets my look super elevated. I'm the Charlotte Tilbury Lip Color and Hot Gossip. I know we wear masks these days and usually lipstick is not the go-to choice but I just love lipstick. I just love it. I'll reapply, I'll like, you know, do whatever it takes to keep my lipstick intact. I just have a skin color. This is a Charlotte Tilbury lip color in Wedding Bells. Just a neutral nude color. Nice soft matte formulation. It's not sticky, it's not long lasting. I don't really care about the long lasting factor. I never do. When you put stuff in products that are long lasting, you have to make it a little dry, like you know, and that's how it becomes drying for you on your lip, face, whatever it is. And I don't like the matte effect unless it's a liquid lipstick. You know, if it's a bullet lipstick, I like it to be soft and transferable. I don't mind pulling out my lipstick for my purse and just like doing a little touch up in the bathroom and coming out. I touch up my lipstick 24-7 when I'm, when I'm out. You'll never see me with a bare lip. I'll have lip gloss, I'll have lip oils, I'll have lipstick, because lipstick's my thing, okay? So I don't want it to be long lasting and sticky. It's just too drying for someone like me. So yeah, soft, matte, comfortable formula, just a color. There you go. That's me outfit, baby. I'm just gonna wear regular shoes. I'm telling you, the place is so close to me that, you know, I'm not looking to do anything fancy. This is my bag from Zara. I'm like drenched in Zara H&M. This just, and then yeah, this is just a bigger bag, you know, to keep my camera and stuff. We're waiting on the Uber, and this is Varsha. Hi. <laughs> She's gonna be vlogging some bits that I show you guys. We have a few things planned. At least I know what I wanna get. I wanna get a table runner for my table. I wanna get placemats, cause the one that I got, it's cloth. And if I drop anything on that dude, it's <laughs> over. <laughs> the stains just don't go. It, they don't it's go. over and haldi and all bhai <laughs> nahi ho paega. So I got that but I think I'm gonna like gift it to someone or something. They're very cute placemats. But I want like the circular jute placemats and then I wanna I don't know, I wanna see yes, I want cutlery holder. So like I wanna keep spoons on the table, but a very cute looking one. We're on our way. Yay! Finally the West Side shopping I wanted to do for a while is happening. I got time only now and that too very little because I have to get back soon. West side. We're going <laughs> into this home section. <laughs> tell, never tell. Just trust that I'll keep it locked in a cell. Never revealing no secrets. You're keeping these promises strong as a spell. I'll never tell. Like you, that's for sure. Never have to close the door. Been a long time, a year before, and I'm missing you so bad. Gone away, a month or more. Every show I go before, I need to hear that voice. Cause right now it feels like it's been too long. I could never let, let you go, go. Who's having a new horn? <laughs> Who's having a new horn? 
Not me. <laughs> Actually, really nice things. They're very good. Like you want a box. <laughs> 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 it's for seven nine nine, and you get four pieces. This is for seven nine nine, and you get two pieces. I'll never tell, never tell. Just trust that I'll keep it locked in a cell. Never revealing no secrets you're keeping these promises strong as a They have everything I'm going mad I that's why I can't come with Akhil like I can't he'll keep everything down be like we don't need but we need for aesthetics we need And you might be thinking Mars what the hell is this for I will tell you what it's for when we go home <laughs> It's entire all nude. Neutral. There's no neutral. color at all. Zero color. <laughs> Why is my name Malvika? Should be nude. It's quite heavy. It's quite heavy. Back home in my PJs, and we're about to set the table. This is the potential look of the table. The runner ran short. <laughs> it should have ran below. Yeah, it my table is a little bit on the sides. Yeah, but this is so far the placemats. I think it looks really cute just for aesthetic purpose. Um, I think yeah, this is great. This is the runner beige and gold. Nice. Do you think the pink one was better? No, no. I don't know. I don't think. Because it's it was too close to the table color, I feel. Not like I've done some course over here, but <laughs> this is the cutlery stand which we will keep over here on the side. This tissue has to move. It could also be in the center. Okay, so this is the tray. And you can use this as a cheese board with like a dip and stuff. But I had another idea. So this place is super messy, and like you can see, the oil on the water from below. Look at the stains. Can you see? So can you see the stains? So this is what I want to get rid of. I'm not liking this. Yeah, I'm Gower than here. So yeah, and I'll tell you why this happened. It's because you know it just like went seeped right through it. So I'm gonna get this out and get, find some other place. And then we replace it with something good quality and heavy and of this color because it matches my board. I'm obsessed. I need to really do interior designing. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen this in a lot of hauls and that's why I got the idea. I bought this olive oil bottle. Oops, it's slippery. So, you know, something like this. And then I have my pink salt grinder here. And then I've got ajwain, which I don't need to keep here. I'm not that gassy. <laughs> and then I have olive oil. See? You see the difference? Heels feet. Very cute. <laughs> right, and it doesn't occupy this much space. So what I did is I took off that much space and I just yeah. made it a single. Can you see? Yeah. So now I have more space to put stuff if I ever need to. And you can just push this to the side and that's, there you go. But yeah, and you can keep your tissue. So earlier my tissue was there, now it's kept here. Um, but I can literally use this for my tissue. You see? 
okay this is my couch you guys have seen it a million times and i am bored of my pillow covers and i want to change it so now the thing about this is these are all previous pillows that are super flat and there's another pillow in it if you can see <laughs> right so i'm going to change that and make it now poofy and all one size so i bought one pillow two pillow covers which is this nude color it has a texture and i love love textures that's why even this has a texture and all of these are west side by the way all how look how fluffy 799 per cushion they are charging a exorbitant price So this is now what my hall is looking like. I definitely put my throw blanket here instead of putting it here because I already have a golden one here. Right? So, yeah. And the pillow I have is from here where sides look 40 cm to 40 cm. Hello. I'm all set to go to mom's house. I wore this for the first time, but I've had it for a while. It's this white kurti and pajama from Gerua. I got it from Mintra and it fits so well. Um I don't know the size. It's a medium. <laughs> it's a medium. And yeah, it's just you know I'm going to be sitting on the ground and eating like all of us are. This is the earring I purchased today from Westside. I like stuff like this, you know, something that's not so big. Um the big ones are good for either weddings or shoots. I think when I shoot an Indian look, big ones look beautiful, you know. So every day ke liye ye kafi hai. And yes, I am ready. I'm so excited to eat like ten thousand varieties that she's made. So let's go. You this baby. So far though. You look amazing. Real flowers. Real flowers. Real flowers. Real flowers. Real flowers. Wow, look at Jane. <laughs> Jay, where's my outfit, bro? <laughs> you look really oh, good. Hi, hi, my sweet girl. Hi. Hello. You look so good. Oh my God, look at him. Took me really long to figure this out, but I did finally. Yeah, he did. Look at Chloe. Look at Jay with the lungi, you guys. He really, really did it. Well, I did it. Okay, okay, Chloe. You look amazing. <laughs> so pretty. Coconut drink. Thank you. Uh, uh, what you want? Sabza. Sabza. Wow, it's yeah. really good. Yeah, this is very good. Can we use this? Welcome drink. Mm. Yum. Mm. Look at this, you guys. Everything wow. is uh, vegan. It's vegan. <laughs> Everything is disposable Natural. because there's a lot of food. Yes. Sambar. This is uh, same paisa, bendi, bendi, a lady finger. This is karela with ambadi. <laughs> this is uh, red leaves, baji. This is sprouts. This is uh, carrot, stir fry, stained leaf. This is oh. padwal with the moong dal and chana dal. Um, this is mooli sabzi and string beans. Oh my! Gosh. And salad. Oh my god and handmade date chutney onion pickle chaat and papad and rice <laughs> what <laughs> my mom has done it you are like the true chef of life you look so good yeah yeah you look so and alex is here it's your second night and he's having a pure south indian <laughs> dinner with us and Amazing. And he loves Indian food, do you? I do, I do, especially vegan. Indian vegan. Food. Would you like to say something in French to my audience? Anything? How happy you are to be here, whatever. You guys will flip. <laughs> j'adore l'Inde et j'adore la, la nourriture indienne. Et merci beaucoup de m'avoir invité ce soir. Girls are falling everywhere. <laughs> single is single here. Single is here, guys. We all married, but this uh, single can, South Indian. I can speak French too. You're all dark and handsome. Alex, you, you need to teach me French. <laughs> Welcome, 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 welcome,
<laughs> Look at him, you guys. First time wearing a lungi. He looks so cute. <laughs> yeah. I bought this matika thing. Yeah. You can pull from here. Oh, <laughs> so stylish. <laughs> now you have to keep it ganji for some time. Ah. For a week. Ganji. R rice water. Ah, rice water. Then this, uh, then the red, good to go. Wow, it looks matika. so good. You love, my mom loves matka stuff. You can drink water in the morning. It's so good. Yeah. She guides me with the sun and light of me. It ain't over. It ain't over. It ain't over. It ain't over. Mm -hmm. I'm not the dog. I just want me to find it. Cause I'm not the dog. I just want me to find it. Effort for your time and the blessing that you put in every single grain of this beautiful meal for all of us. You bring happiness and fulfillment in all of our lives. We are very grateful for you, for your teachings, and for God to have brought us into your lives and for you to have come into ours. Thank you very much for this beautiful meal. Uh, God bless you and all of us. Thank you. Thank you. Let's eat. Let's eat. Let's eat. Let's eat. In. Break the bojan. Chalo. Yay. <laughs> It's 23rd October and it's a new day. Yesterday we ate so much and just straight away came home and went to bed because I was so full. We had such a good time like you guys saw of course. I have a couple of things to do today. It's a Saturday. I think I will... I don't know if I'll film this week. Like I said, I haven't filmed anything. I think I need to start afresh next week and that's completely fine. I'm still working. I'm vlogging. <laughs> So I got a package yesterday that came in, that's the one and I ordered a bunch of Bath & Body Works stuff, you guys know I love their candles. So I got some candles, I got some hand washes, for some reason I feel like Dettol and Lifebuoy is not doing it for me anymore, whenever I go to someone else's like chic house or um, you know a house opening they always have bath and body works and i'm just like wow so then i buy it it gets over and then i switch back to Dettol, and then i'm just like i'm not enjoying this i need the whole experience so that's why i call for a bunch of hand washes that i got in 500 rupees i know it's a lot for hand wash but i just since i'm doing my house and just creating the aesthetics of it even more i feel like hand washes also matter just the after effects of how it smells I just care about shit like this. Like, you know, not everyone has to, but I do. All right, Bath and Body Works, baby.
so this is the first flavor I got and it's so oh my god it smells amazing this is the beach sage and mint scented candle um, and it says yeah oh my god Ugh, I knew it this would be good I just knew it sometimes I just know what candles would smell like it's really hard to say when it's named Fiji sands or something like it's hard to say what notes they would use but beach sage and mint sounded so good girl it is a dream it is so good it smells it definitely has very slight calming and minty sensation it's not like toothpaste you know i hate mint but this is just the perfect mint you can burn this in a cool weather in front of you you see a lake you see little snow dogs running around you see pine trees and it's sweater weather you're wearing a sweater you're sitting in a fireplace and you're burning this that's how it smells like now however you want to interpret that is on you <laughs> stunning stunning so beautiful the packaging is by the way this is the next one mahogany teak wood this is one of my favorite scents um, i finished it all the way to the bottom i finished two so i called for another one it is so beautiful yes this smells like hot you know hot sexy night out of the town you're getting ready for a date and your man just got out of the shower and it's just a sexy i don't know it's giving me very sexy it's like mahogany teak wood you know it's sexy that's all i can just i know sexy is a very weird word but it's just very chic it's it's sensual you know wow i'm so bad at describing scents but it's very sensual yeah it's not like comfy cozy nothing it's like straight up yes i'm gonna wear a pair of heels we're gonna just strut out of the town and come back and this would be our like <sighs> it's sexy this is the candle mahogany teak wood and then wow wow this packaging is so beautiful it I bought this specially for the packaging because hello, I can keep this right behind my filming table and I love how white and beautiful it is. So, okay, this is super interesting. I did not think it would smell like this. It's salted ocean air. I can imagine how this would be salted ocean American air. Yeah, it has coconut. For sure, it's got coconut. It's got this hint of coconut. I, I don't want to be wrong, but I'm getting a coconut vibe, okay? And yeah, like some saltiness. It's gorgeous. I, I would think of a beach when I smell this, so that's what you think. I don't have anything else to describe it as. It's like beachy, um, salty hair. Mm, sitting by and having a peach iced tea. Not something alcohol, but iced tea. And you're smelling the breeze of the ocean and the beach. Like the beach, basically. And the waves are hitting you. <laughs> so good, I'm happy with all three scents. So I knew mahogany teak wood and I knew how it smelled. I just did not know the other two and I winged it. I'm just like, let's see, you know. So yes, it's beautiful and stunning. I'm so glad I'm gonna actually use this till the bottom. That's what it is, so yay. Cool, let's see our hand washes now. Okay, so now for hand washes, we have this. So pretty looking, like the bottle's also so cute. And it is the Aromatherapy Natural Essentials Oil, Eucalyptus and Spearmint. And it's a gentle foaming hand wash, so it's foamy. I, I generally don't like foam hand washes simply because it's just not enough to wash my hands well. It's fun, but it's not enough. So that's why I buy the gel version, but they didn't have it in that, so that's why I picked up this. I'm gonna keep this in the guest bathroom. I'm so excited. Then I have the White Barn Cotton and Freesia Gentle Foaming Soap. This is how it looks. Surprisingly, it is green. Both are green. It's got, it's made with vitamin E, shea extract and aloe. Soft cotton, jasmine and fresh foods are the notes. I don't know why people don't write notes behind. It's important. Then look at this packaging. We've got vanilla coconut. You know how much I love coconut and vanilla. Um, it's a gentle foaming hand wash. I just didn't think too much of it. I just purchased it because I love how it looked. Coconut and vanilla and what else is that? Peach blossom. Yep. Love this. 
And then the last hand wash is this one. It's the White Barn, The Perfect Autumn. Look how beautiful the packaging is. So The Perfect Autumn just like got me in because I was like, yes, it, it's yellow. It's got pumpkins on it. That means we're in the fall weather. Not in Bombay or India, but just like in general, the fall is here. And I think it's just a pretty bottle to have. So I have not obviously, I don't know what this smells like at all, but I'm very excited to put this in all of my bathrooms and begin using them. And then I have one more thing which I got. This is the Vanilla and Patchouli Concentrated Room Spray. And this is how it looks. Small bottle of room spray and it's so powerful. I have one in the sun drenched linen. One spray is enough to just spray up the room, you know, one spray. It's so beautiful. Ooh, this is just like the body oil. It's exactly, they have a full range. They had a body oil, but now they don't have body oils anymore. I don't know why, but it smells exactly like their entire range. So this is how my table looks in the daytime. I wanted to show you in full light. How beautiful. I'm obsessed with this table. Um, it's appearing more orange than it is on camera because the contrast is high on the camera. But yeah, it is like a warm wood, you know? So I purposely asked for that because I feel like it feels very cozy. And yes, I this is the best decision I made. This makes anything look cozy and warm and rustic, which is the look I'm going for for my table. So yeah, everything matches. The set, the center thing, everything is going so well along with this beautiful tissue holder. <laughs> so yeah, if you see my dining table, it looks like this. Hi guys, it's lunchtime and it's a Saturday. I'm usually by myself on a Saturday afternoon because we work Monday to Friday and Saturday, Sunday is off to tea for all of us. Um, I just love the atmosphere of our house. It's so comfortable and sunny and quiet. I just love my own company. So it doesn't matter. I just eat my own food. I read my book. I watch my show. Like I literally, it's fulfilling spending time alone for me because I get time to myself. During the week, I don't get time at all to myself. Um, let me show you what I'm eating. It's definitely not kicha. It's like, I don't know, we call it chendige. And then alu methi, this is chavli and raita and achar and roti. Yep, that's my lunch, super vast. I eat a good lunch. And this is my view, which is my favorite ever. So yes, I just love sitting on my table and eating. This, we are at Akhil's new office right now. So fun to see this happen from ground zero to now. Amazing. Yeah, it's so young. I'm already like... Shit. I'm a quiche. What's up? Tear my vlog. <laughs> Ow, the spoon's so hot. Because uh, we're starting a new campaign. It's been a long day. It's a month. Look at my hair. <laughs> <laughs> this is too much even for her. Face is so dry and dull. But yeah, that's all the news I have so far. I am going to eat and then get to filming. See you.